we often make medicine a lot more complex than it really is. We see chronic diseases like heart disease, cancer, Alzheimer's as separate diseases. But in reality, they are simply different manifestations of inflammation. We know about classic inflammation, that hurts. That's why you see a doctor. But we now know there's a second type of inflammation. I call it silent inflammation. This is inflammation below the perception of pain. And since there's no pain, you have nothing to stop it. This type of inflammation can attack your organs, every cell in your organs, over a period of years, if not decades, until there's enough in-organ damage, we call it chronic disease. Now, how do you know if you have silent inflammation? Well, there is a blood test that I've developed. But if you're like me, you probably hate taking blood tests. Is there any other indication that you may have high levels of silent inflammation? There's no one factor, but there's a litany of questions you can ask. And if you can answer yes to more than three of these questions, it's quite likely you have high levels of silent inflammation. The first question is, are you overweight? Well, there's two thirds of Americans right there. Another question might be, are you taking cholesterol lowering drugs like statins? Or are you taking drugs for hypertension like beta blockers or diuretics? Or are you constantly groggy upon awakening? Are you constantly craving carbohydrates throughout the day? Are you fatigued throughout the day? Are your fingernails brittle? If you can answer yes to three or more of these questions, you probably have high levels of silent inflammation. There's no drug known in the medical science that can reverse silent inflammation, but the anti-inflammatory zone diet can. In fact, it's been clinically shown within 30 days, you can see significant reductions of silent inflammation. And by controlling that, that becomes your pathway to reaching wellness and maintaining it for the rest of your life.